right, so we're in the workshop. It's a very cool space. Let's talk about what we have in here. Yeah, so the concept behind this workshop is to have open workspace available for our community to build larger projects and build them better. Mm -hmm. So you'll see a lot of open workbenches that are reservable to our members okay. uh, who are doing big assembly work, like furniture. Uh, you can see someone doing uh, drum assembly. Oh, very cool. And obviously with COVID and the pandemic going on, so can you just talk about what you're, or what you're doing to kind of keep everybody safe, the members? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so we've been around for about 10 years and we've always been about safety because we have a lot of big equipment here. Um, so one of the things we did is we're requiring members to reserve space ahead of time. Uh, we upped our disinfectant and cleaning rate. We upgraded our uh, filtration system. These common spaces and co-working spaces are so important to businesses. So trying to be open and available as possible. Obviously, again, with the COVID and all that good stuff, we're not accepting new members. Is that correct? How are you doing there so far? Right now, we're open only to our current member base who stayed with us through the pandemic, um, mainly due to the fact that we can't teach in-person classes. We're maintaining that six foot distance. Masks are required. Uh, but people who are interested in being members can be added to a wait list. Um, or they can apply for private space. Uh, these are eight by eight units. You can register your business address here. Uh, you'll get 24 hour access to the building eventually. Um, and you can actually run your business out of here. So ship and receive from here. Um, we really want it to function as a home base for people and have a supportive community around it. Very cool. And with the new space, you are talking about doing some really cool stuff. So let's go check out some of the ideas that you have moving forward once everybody's open and can come through. All right, Anna, so take a look at the new space. It's uh, incredible, it's huge, 20,000 square feet or so. 20,000 square feet for us, but 60,000 square feet for the whole building. A lot of uh, great outdoor and indoor space, huge parking lot, which is rare in Philadelphia. Um, so once we're able, we definitely will use it, utilizing this to bring in the community uh, and also to experience some of our makers who are doing things like jewelry making, woodworking, furniture making, welding, sculpture. It sounds great, it looks great. Where can the people find NextFab and maybe potentially become a member? You can go to nextfab.com. Uh, you'll see actually our membership wait list pops up right when you get there. Uh, and if you're interested in renting private space, you can just fill that out uh, and you'll get an email with next steps. And with the current members that are utilizing the spaces, again, make sure you bring a mask, all that good stuff. Yeah, make sure you bring a mask. Uh, make sure you sign in when you get here um, and maintain your six foot distance and reserve your space ahead of time. Awesome. Thank you so much, Anna. Yeah.